Hi, I'm John Parmenter, and welcome to the 2007 series of technical video seminars from Precision International. We hope you enjoy them. Four R70 series of transmissions have been in the shops since 1998 and providing us with a lot of high volume work on repairs. We're going to address today the EPC changes regarding this transmission. The transmission originally started out with having an EPC solenoid that had a blue connector for the wiring harness. In 2001 model year it changed to a brown case connector for the wiring harness for the pressure control solenoid. In 2005, we have now changed to a black case connector. These pressure control solenoids all work at the same rate. They all have the same ohms rating. We've seen them react differently to pressure control changes. So please keep in mind what year you're working on and what color solenoid belongs in that vehicle. We've also seen in the aftermarket a yellow case connector marked like this. We recommend highly you consult with your parts manufacturer as to what belongs in the vehicle. If you have a drivability concern and you're checking the vehicle out, be sure to notice that this 05 black solenoid, many technicians have been replacing the yellow one for the black one. It has worked occasionally. It has created some drivability concerns. Please consult the attached chart as far as which solenoid works in which of your vehicle, and we hope this information helps you do a quality repair. Thank you very much. <laughs> now that we've addressed the EPC solenoid concerns and changes throughout the various 4R70 transmission series, we're now looking at the retainer bracket which holds the pressure control solenoid in place. Notice that in original design in 1998, it had a notched or squared off retainer which locked into the pressure control solenoid. In the 2005 model year, we've now gone to a round design. These can be easily confused and mismatched, and when you put the wrong one on the wrong solenoid, it will pull the solenoid off its seat, causing erratic line pressure. This is easily overlooked by many a quality rebuilder. We have given you a chart to designate the early and the late model of brackets. Please be aware of this fact as the 05 vehicles are now coming into the shop at great frequency. We hope this information has helped you. Keep it on file, you're going to need it. We hope you've enjoyed today's technical training video. I gotta go on a road test right now, so we'll see you guys around.